So one day, as John Phillips said, he went to design a shoe warehouse in Ithaca to buy a pair of shoes. And the girl that checked out his purchase at the register was Miranda. And JP likes to say it this way. She was checking me out. <laughs> but he never says that he was checking her out. But I want to add that in because I know he was. He I, was I was, I was. <laughs> You never know in life when you will meet that one person, that one person you want to spend the rest of your life with. Growing up, I imagined these scenarios of how I'd meet the girl of my dreams. Well, as the old saying goes, expect the unexpected. When I walked into that shoe store that one fateful December day, I didn't realize that I would be finding not only a great pair of shoes, but a person that I would want to spend every moment with for the rest of my days. JP, I can't believe we have finally made it to this day. It feels like just yesterday that I was working at DSW and you came in. I remember seeing you in the back corner trying on shoes <laughs> and then you looked up there and you smiled at me. I went home and I joked with my mom that day that I met a really cute guy and that I found the man that I was going to marry. I vow to love and care for you, and I will try in every way to be worthy of your love. I will always be honest with you, kind, patient, and forgiven. I promise to grow with you and love every version of you to come. I promise to love you forever, in good times and hard with everything that I have. Aww, you're so beautiful. But most of all, I promise to be true and loyal friend to you. I'll always be at your side. I will love you for all the days of my life. You are my home away from home, and wherever we go together, I can never be homesick with you by my side. I love you. Love you, little friend. Declare your loving vows before your loved ones. May God confirm your covenant and fill you both with grace. Now that John Philip and Miranda have given themselves to each other by solemn vows with the joining of hands and the giving of rings, I announce to you that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Those whom God has joined together, let no one separate. John Philip, you may kiss your bride.
It is my absolute honor to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. JP and Miranda. They say having a sister is having a built-in best friend, but I think that is something we learned a little later in life as we molded our adult lives together. And even now that we are stretched miles apart, carrying out our own lives, the Russell sisterhood remains strong. And I think nothing rings more true than knowing that home is where the heart is. And I think I can speak for everyone when I say how much peace and happiness it brings me seeing Miranda's heart find its home with JP. And even though today may be your official day of union, and I could stand up here and say how happy I am to gain a brother, the truth is that JP became a member of our family from the beginning. We all knew he was gonna be the one when we could see how he lit up Miranda's eyes the day she brought him home. JP is one of the most like accepting and encouraging guys you'll ever you'll ever meet. He'll like meet you where you are in life, wherever it is. I mean, aside from the fact that he literally has to like bend down to like get eye to eye with you because he's so tall. Miranda, you're you're in for a ride, and you, he will frustrate you for sure. But uh, it'll it'll be a good ride, and um, I'm so happy for you too, and I love you. Cheers. Woo!